While we have to deal with, with ticks and Lyme disease and all of the potential uh, pitfalls of running a camp, you know, the, the upside far outweighs the, the downside. Nestled on the shores of Long Lake, Camp Takahoe in Naples is more than just a summer camp. It's a home away from home for its more than 400 campers each summer. And although their days are often spent outdoors, developing socially and emotionally, at night the camp's priority is maintaining physical health with daily and weekly tick checks. Our responsibility is to act as a reasonable parent would act. So if a mom and dad would be checking their child for ticks on a daily basis, then our, that's our responsibility. Aside from their rigorous training for staff on how to spot and remove ticks, they also have seven nurses and a pediatric surgeon in residency, Dr. Robert Bellin. The ticks are almost microscopic. Yeah. They're pinhead size. I think that the parents really appreciate uh, knowing that we do all that. At their on-site health center, ticks are removed and sometimes sent away for testing and where campers can be treated for any concerns. We try to prevent it before it occurs and uh, that way everybody has a good summer. And it's not just after the fact where the camp is taking ticks seriously, it's before every camper's ventures outside. We're dousing the, the, the campers with, you know, the, you know, the bug sprays. And another reason for their well-kept grounds. You know, we don't have those, those high grass areas and, and you know, where, where ticks like to, to spend their time. And although owner Jeff Koningsberg says he is particularly proud of the high standards his camp maintains, he believes camps as a whole in Maine are stepping up to curb this growing health crisis. But I think a lot of the camps in this state are doing what we're doing. And I think that they understand and appreciate the importance of, of child safety. In Naples, Aaron Dixon, WMTW News 8.